hide under the bed. You gone nuts? Come on, come on, get under the bed. Now this has got to be the oldest trick in the book. It always works in the movies. Come on. So damn Always works in the movies, huh? Hey, you can hide under the bed. You gone nuts? Hey, maybe we could hide in the shower. That ain't the brightest idea I ever heard, kid. This is crazy. Better than that old timer. What the hell? Vito. Uh, fuck. Hmm, maybe we can fit in here. You gone nuts? What, the both of us? I ain't no queer. I ain't gonna lock myself in a Come cabinet on, with another Just get guy. in there, Leo. We don't have time. <laughs> hey, don't stand so close. You move over. No, you move over. Shh, shut up. Hey, that better be your gun. Shut up. What the hell? Hey, Henry. Vito? This your friend? No, he just wants to hang up his jacket. All right, come on, come on, get out of there. It's about damn time you come out of the closet. Vito! What the hell are you doing here? Take it easy, Henry. Put the gun down and send the guys away. I'm gonna explain everything. Boys, wait for me outside. If I don't come out in a few minutes, come looking for me. Get in there. Okay, Vito. Now get me over to the train station if you wouldn't mind.
Vito. You said we don't have much time. Okay, Vito. Now, get me over to the train station, if you wouldn't mind. We could get down to the backyard this way. Just need a rope or something. Go get some sheets from the laundry. The sheets. All right, here we go. Come on. Tight is tight. <clears throat> All right, go ahead, Leo. Damn it. Shh, Leo. I'm too old for this shit. I down with you. Yeah. This guy don't kill me. You Come and on. your crazy right behind you. Let's go. So what are you going to do now? Well, first, let's get out of here. No arguments here. Fuck shit! Okay, Vito. Now, get me over to the train station, if you wouldn't mind. This town's been good to me. But now it's time to say goodbye. You gonna go there in your PJs? Damn right I am. I'd rather be alive in my pajamas than dead in a three-piece suit. You, uh... gonna tell Frank what happened? Sure I am. But don't worry, I ain't gonna mention your name. You're gonna have enough to worry about as it is. Thanks, Leo. You know, this whole thing got... complicated. Real fast, you know? Of course it did, Vito. What did you expect? You swear the oath, you put on a fancy suit, and then it's one big party? Carlo's always been a shady bastard. Even for guys in this business. I've been warning Frank about him for years. So what are you gonna do now? I'm gonna disappear. Let things run their course. I'm gonna take the first train to Lost Heaven. Phone calls, settle my affairs. And then I'm gonna head for the airport. And I'm gonna go someplace warm. This time tomorrow, I'm gonna be sitting on a beach somewhere, sipping one of them fruity drinks with the umbrella in them. One thing's for sure. If Carlo wants me dead, then staying around here is like buying a one-way ticket to the morgue. Isn't that a little drastic? No, I've been meaning to retire anyway. When you get to be my age, Vito, then all this squabbling starts to seem a little pointless. Frank's never gonna change. He's a brawler. Nowadays, he just listens to the young hotheads because they tell him what he wants to hear. If he wants to be some kind of wise guy sheriff and go after Carlo, then he can do it without me. I'm just sorry I got you into this mess. It was my choice, Leo. All you did was speed things up a little. Besides, what the hell else was I gonna do? Go work on the docks like my old man? <laughs> You're preaching to the choir, kid. So, what are your plans, Vito? Looks like you're entered up to your neck right now. I don't really got any. I guess I just want to make a shitload of dough and not get my head blown off in the process. Ah, real original. It ain't as easy as it sounds, kid. Trust me on that. All right, here it is. Thanks for everything, Vito. Just promise me that you're never gonna be as stupid as you were today, risking your neck like this just to buy an old man a few more years. Enjoy your vacation, old man. Hey, get your shoes shine here. Lake, park, scene dark, silvery moon is shining through the trees. Cast to me, you, sound of kisses floating on the breeze. Act one.